Do you ever wonder why so many kids today are chronically sick and struggling with their health? Or why so many of us parents are constantly stressed out, worn out, sick, and struggling ourselves? What if one thing could be connected to almost every single health challenge that our families face in today's crazy world? What if we told you this one thing would be almost too simple and too straightforward to understand? If it feels like you've tried absolutely everything to get your family healthy and it just hasn't clicked yet, you've got to watch this video and learn all about the greatest health hack there is. Addressing subluxation and stress on the nervous system. So for PJ and his family, this was their exact story. They lived the definition of a natural and a healthy life. They even moved to a farm, raised their own animals, and grew their own food. They tried every single natural diet, detox, supplement, essential oil, and still their daughter would hold onto a cold or illness for so long that she was missing one to two weeks of school every single month. She was in danger of being held back a year and not moving on to the next grade. So this story, it is so much more common than you'd think. If you name any single pediatric health condition from allergies and asthma to autism, anxiety, ADHD, it is all on the rise due to this crazy stressful and toxic world that we currently live in. While modern medicine, they still blame genetics and bad luck for our family's poor health, the truth is that the science and the research shows us, and it has for years, that it's a perfect storm of factors and stressors, not one single thing alone that negatively impacts our kids' health. And it starts very early in life, as far back as pregnancy, labor and delivery, and early childhood. All of these stressors, they add up to an overwhelmed and an out of balance nervous system, and that causes the body to shift into an overactive and sustained sympathetic fight or flight response. It's a condition that we call subluxation. The first thing that subluxation and sympathetic dominance negatively affect are the core elements of health. It's our sleep, our gut health, our immune system, our motor development. And then from there, it progresses even deeper into the brain and the nervous system, which then starts to affect mental and emotional health, behavior, focus, concentration, speech, so much more. So how do you know if subluxations exist in your child or in your family members? In infants, the first signs of subluxation, they're typically difficulty latching, sleeping, soothing, eating, and pooping. And then in toddlers, subluxation presents its chronic ear infections, respiratory challenges, constipation, gross motor delays, sensory challenges, and just many explosive tantrums and meltdowns, and even speech delays. Then if the child's a grade schooler, subluxation is gonna look like focus and concentration challenges, behavior and emotional dysregulation issues, anxiety, and just chronic gut and immune challenges overall. Then once they hit those teen and adult years, this is when we start to see chronic fatigue, brain fog, exhaustion, and that anxiety becomes depression. And it's not just those signs and symptoms that we use to diagnose subluxation in our practice. Here at Foundations, we use an incredible piece of technology that is changing not just chiropractic, but healthcare in a major, major way. This allows us to find, measure, and detect that subluxation or that sympathetic dominance and any neurological imbalance in anyone in the family. So our scans can be run on infants as young as a few hours old, and in a matter of minutes, you can finally find the real root cause of your family's health challenges. If you're interested in seeing these scans for yourself, send us a message give us a call. We are happy to help you get started on your healing journey.